Hey, BR Tidwell 55 here. Uh, last video I posted in my review of Ubuntu 9.10. Uh, the biggest complaint I had was the speed of Firefox. It was just the default installation of Firefox with uh, with uh, Ubuntu 9.10 is just incredibly, incredibly slow. Uh, so I have found some tricks uh, to speed it up and I'm going to share those with you now. Now the first thing I did uh, was I thought it might be my system configuration and I honestly I uh, did several things I don't know which was the exact one that actually did the trick but I'm going to share all of them with you and uh, uh, so anyway so one of the things I did was I, I pointed uh, the computer itself uh, at a DNS server uh, rather than using my uh, home router using the uh, using the DNS password on my own router so uh, I found uh, the DNS servers that my ISP points at and then I went into uh, uh, system preferences network connections under I'm using a wired uh, connection so I clicked I clicked on the name of you click on the name of your uh, connection click at it and uh, this dialog opens up go over to the IPv4 settings and then uh, you'll choose automatic DHCP addresses only and what that's going to do is it will open up and allow you it'll open up these boxes uh, you, ty uh, you type in the IP address of your uh, DNS server and then hit apply. Okay, that was that way uh, the logic behind that is is I've already got uh, a DNS server in the computer itself uh, network connection folder so it doesn't have to take that extra time to go to my home router and get a DNS uh, server to resolve IP addresses. So that's the logic behind that. And then I did a search online for some tricks to speed up uh, Firefox 3 and I came to this page. I'll post the address in the comments section. But one of the things it talks about doing, uh, number two, is HTTP pipeline. And what you do to enable that is, well what I did was I just opened up another tab and what you're going to do is you're going to type in the address bar you type about colon config you get this warning and just switch back to the other page for reference what you're going to do is you're going to uh, look for a tag that says network.http.pipelining and everything is alphabetical so just scroll down to it okay not okay now what you're going to do is you'll click on that right click on it and you uh or you just double click on it and that will change the value from false to true. And then you look at the next one, the network.http.pipelining request. Uh, you right click on that and hit modify and change the value from 4 to 8. And then there is a tag that you actually add in there and that is uh, What you do is you're creating a new integer value, and it's ng dot ng layout dot initial initial paint dot delay. And to set that, you just right click anywhere in there, hit new, and you'll choose integer, and you'll get a dialog that asks you the name of it, and you just you type in that name, and you set the value of it uh, zero. Close.
close out Firefox, restart your computer, and I tell you, after I did this, I mean, it uh, it went from uh, growing old trying to wait on pages to load to uh, silly fast. I mean, it runs as fast as uh, it runs as fast or faster than Chrome does on on the Windows 7 setup. So anyway, it's uh, the all of those together. I don't know which one in of itself did the trick, or if it's all of them working together. But I mean, just to show you, I mean that that's just how fast pages load. Uh, go to uh, I'll go to a page that I know isn't in my cache anywhere. Uh, go to Hulu. I know that page isn't in my cache anywhere. You know, and that's just crazy fast page loads, so. Anyway, I fixed that little annoyance. Hope this helps, and uh, thanks for watching.